Coin News 6. News that's to the point. If there's one thing educators have learned over the years, it's that one size does not fit all. Just because a school is performing well doesn't mean its students will do the same. Coin News 6 reporter Eric Taylor has shown us public and private schools that work. Tonight, a different kind of school. In tonight's special report, Making the Grade. The reason why Alpha High School is so appropriately named is because it gives students who struggle with larger, more traditional settings a new start. Students who drop out and may not finish high school tend to finish when they enter Alpha. Why? Because Alpha thinks outside the classroom. Nick Asbury is not your average high school student, and this concrete accessories shop is not your average classroom. And this teaches you a great deal of work, work ethic that you can actually use later, and you can take it to the bank, you know? I mean, it's, it's worth something. There you go, my friend. Look at all that stuff right there. Concrete Special Ties is just one of hundreds of workplace partners with Alpha High School. It's this hands-on, job skills intensive experience that makes Alpha different and work so well. Half of Nick's day is spent here, the yeah, other half he this. spends in class. That I'm getting out here, I'm doing something that I'm going to be more prepared to go to work. And I'm less likely to be homeless or unemployed because of this program, primarily. It's not pointless. The actually, program has 60 students who found traditional high school too big, too intimidating, or simply irrelevant. In a new building with community garden outside, small classes focus on just a few topics at a time, but go deeper. Learning, I don't have to deal with so many kids answer, like asking a million different questions and no, nothing getting learned. I get to like ask the teacher one-on-one, -on -one, how do I do this, and they'll explain it to me and not the entire class. Adrian Barbaris didn't see the need for college. She does now. Instructor Jennifer Stone says here, students aren't considered second-class academic citizens, that the different approach is as dignified as any. We're not the kind of program that says, well, give us this kid you're having problems with and we'll fix them and give them back. That's really not what we're about. What we're about is providing a different path. Right, and then all this customers coming up right now. A path that not only provides an education and job skills, but provides training on practical life skills as well. Everything from buying a home to buying insurance is covered. All of it part of a program that puts success within reach of everyone. Alpha High School is run by the Multnomah County Educational Service District, which serves eight different school districts. Eric Taylor, COIN News 6.